I was reading the comments on my last video and I saw so many people are like, you should bring Demon Hendrickson. And I was like, should have done that in the first place, honestly. Uh, so we're going to try it out. If you don't know why Demon Hendrickson is because his passive is, and his passive works in the back, that every debuff card does extra 50% damage on your team. Very useful. Now, we're going to try that first on Geared, but I've seen that this sort of, uh, th this ability has a much bigger effect on Ungeared. I don't know exactly why, but you can feel the effect way more on Ungeared. So we're going to, we're going to bring it in both. Using the attack crit set. Also, I saw people saying uh, choose Tarmiel as a link for uh, Merlin. That could work too. It's just that with Sario, I see bigger numbers, and bigger numbers give me very good, very good warmth inside. So, anyways, let's see how this goes. Um, any other teams you guys want to see Merlin with? I'll I'll wing it all out. Since people are asking me to try her with Sario again, I can do that. It wasn't very good, but probably I just wasn't using her properly. One big flaw with his team is that I can just attack seal and do this. Uh, attack sealing, of course, is doing extra 50% damage. I'm using Ludo, my favorite boy. Oh, I was hoping, oh good. I want to do the level 3. Using Ludo, my favorite boy. Um, hmm. I kind of do one attack seal. At this, but at the same time, I also do want to level 3. Here's what we're gonna do, right? We're gonna rank up Merlin. Very nice. Attack Seal. Attack Garfield, because I, I want to make sure that he dies next turn. Maybe we should have attacked Meliodas. Maybe. No crits! What's happening? Oh, I'm not using Death Pierce. <laughs> What's happening is that I'm not using Death Pierce. But okay, let's see. Let's see these AoEs. This is the big thing. The debuff card. Doing extra 50% damage. <laughs> Even Melly died. And I'm impressed by that because Melly, if you don't know, PvP rule. Type Disadvantage does 40% less damage than it already does. If you don't know, Type Disadvantage does 30% less damage. So on top of the already the 30, you're doing minus 40 as well. So killing Meliodas right there was quite impressive. Let's try one more here in Geared, and then I also want to wing that on Ungeared as well. Let's see this. One target, 113k. Again. Type advantage, you're doing 30% more damage, but the level 3 stun. Regardless, um, let's play one more, and we might go to ungeared as well, because I want to try that on ungeared too. Just remember, the reason why I couldn't use uh, handy on my previous videos is because I wanted to make a full geared video, and for testing handy, I would have, you know, wanted to play ungeared too. Alright. I think for this one, I'm just gonna go with, with him. I might, I might lose because of it, because I am creating Meliodas there, but I think I should be fine. Let's try it out. Level 2 AoE. It killed Liz! Level 2! Without the rule, I think he wouldn't have, but at level 3, 1 bajillion percent would have killed her. 100% would have. That's c <laughs> extra 50% damage, huh? Again, I want to see this on, on ungeared, because on ungeared, I, I feel like there's a bigger difference. At least for the units I tested, you know, Green Demon, Meldy, um, uh, Jericho, it felt like ungeared had a much bigger difference. Uh, let's make sure you're dead. Actually, let's let's do this, right? Does my kill the... No, 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 no. Attacks you. Level 2 again. And then attack the Meliodas, because it killed the Liz, so it should kill her again. It didn't kill her. It killed Meliodas, but it didn't kill her. Probably because... Oh, yeah. The minus 40% damage there. Ooh, that, that did nothing. Probably because uh, some crits didn't hit. So that that's a little bit of an RNG there. Some crits just didn't land. What can you do? Let's break the shield and uh, attack right after. 
The shield... This attack might actually kill Liz. Oh! Is it a damage level 1? Pretty neat, pretty neat! Before I go to ungear, I kinda wanna see a level 3. Level 3? Level 3? Level 3? Level 3? Nah, I'm okay. Let's get it ready. I'm certain I won't die. So... Let's just do this, right? I'm gonna hope that this will break. The shield. But... Okay, good. It's like, lose going to less damage, but... It actually killed. I don't... <laughs> I didn't know if it was gonna kill. Liz, alright, perfect. Because uh, I didn't want to use the lose the blue unit. But if Liz is there, there's another blue unit. Even though she's not gonna be a defense lawyer, it's fine. I just wanna see level 3. Shield green. Oh, are you kidding me, man? Shield. I just don't have a stun next turn, alright? I have to wait for the shield to go away. Let's rank it up. And who knows, we might get another, sh another rank up next turn. How about that? Rank it up, I'll you waste this and this. Give some slots in case we get another rank up. We can double level 3 next turn. Oh! Mmm! Come on, don't have a shield, don't have a shield, don't have a shield. Or a stun on Merlin? Oh, that was a lot! Okay, stun you for that's perfectly fine. That was a lot! I mean, yeah, she's doing 30% more damage. Bro, that was a lot! Okay, let's, let's see this, let's see this. This is what I'm waiting for, baby. Level 3. 511k. One type advantage, two type neutrals. One of them being tank the end, so I would say that's pretty good. Alright, now we're in ungeared. We'll see how this will go. And I should have put my mask on the left, but that's okay. Also, I just googled this because I, it's been on my mind for a while. But did y'all know that Ludusio has the same voice actor as Gaara from Naruto? I felt like I recognized his voice somewhere for the longest time. And I was like, where is his voice from? It's Gaara from the epic Naruto show. I feel like I'm, the, <laughs> I'm just lost here. gonna hope what's it what's his old level one six okay I should be fine it's not gonna give him any more buffs just the one from go it's fine I, I didn't get go for his ultimate on purpose I kind of don't want it yeah I want to get my uh, Merlin cards okay he's gonna buff himself first which is unfortunate but that's okay we're going to do a big boy, Merlin level 3, will definitely kill Jiro. Killed Ludo, okay. So unfortunately we lost Ludo passive. Oh! Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's all, it's all coming together. It's all coming together, baby! So level 3 is back to back, no lowering from Ludo, but it's okay. That was awful. She really needs that little passive, huh? <laughs> she really needs that little passive to work, huh? Damn. That was terrible. We're not gonna judge too much. Let's let's go let's go with this. How is level 2 doing, huh? No point in waiting. Uh, there's no green girl for passive. See, that's much better. <laughs> Wow, that Ludo passive, plus her own passive, right? For each 4% of HP, she gives herself 1% attack related stats. Man, that was awful. I didn't even kill Dro. I understand not doing too much damage to Meliodas because he gave himself uh, the 50% extra defense in HP, which makes sense. But Dro didn't even die. Dro tanked like a champ. He was like a level 1 
increase on HP related stats. I don't even know, I, it's like what, 12%? I forgot. I should look it up. But Droll took two! Level threes! Like, kill was nothing. That was disheartening, honestly. Wow, that, that's sad. That's, uh, I'm just curious on Droll. I think it's 12. Level one? 15. Very close. I don't know what to say. Maybe Merlin is not very good on ungeared, just in general. Because last time I used her, she also seemed very underwhelming in ungeared. Oh, I forgot to put her in the left. Should have got level three for free there. Ah, it's okay. Let's do this. See how this will go. Maybe she's just not very good in ungeared. Yeah, I feel like she would have done way more in geared PvP. Almost killed the, the the there we are. See, this is the worst possible position for the rank up to be at because if I use the rank up, it's gonna combine into level three anyways. That's really unfortunate. What I'm gonna do is uh, use level two, rank up, use level three. I think the level two will be enough to kill the the. Do I have to? I don't think I have to. Let's just do this. That was pretty good. That just made me sad. I don't know what to say. I feel like she just is much better in geared than she is in ungeared. And not having Ludo's passive made a big difference. I think with Ludo's passive she would have at least killed Joel. Lula's passive makes such a difference. I mean, what can you do? Um, let's move on, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. This this was a bit weird. So here's the reason why I like Death Pierce way more than Hendrickson. I feel like for Val Val I was gonna say Valencia. I mean, applies for Valencia too. But with Merlin, her main damage dealing card is her single target, not her AOE. And Death Pierce helps with both cards, not just one of them. And Hendrickson only helps with the AoE. And I guess it also helps with um, Attack Seal. A lot of Assault Melee is in Ungeared, huh? I guess Ungeared is the place to use Assault Melee. I keep forgetting to put Marley on the left. See, there's nothing I can do. I can't, I can't kill Meliodas. I can definitely kill you. I just hope next turn I get more Merlin cards, I guess. Yeah, look at that. Ooh. Can you give me the AoE? For a second I thought she survived, but it was the passive. Yeah, yeah, I, th I think I can build you this here. He can't heal. Mask will heal. He can't heal. But can she heal? No, she can't, okay. I was like, yeah. He can't heal, so... I can just kill him with my AoEs here. Pog. I thought he was gonna push for an ultimate with Meliodas, but I guess... Uh, he couldn't? Because he only started with one ultimate gauge. Almost killed Meliodas with that. Nice. It, it definitely works. The AoE... Is hitting really hard, but I do like Death Pierce for the single target. And this is what oh, I put the same thing again. What? This is why Demon Henderson works really good. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Please don't have a dodge. Please. 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 Please don't have a dodge. Please don't have a dodge. Demon Henderson works really good for you know, like Blue Jericho or Green Demon Meliodas, where both their attacks are debuffs. Are you kidding me? Oh, one more crit would have killed. Because she does like multiple hits, right? If one of those hits that weren't a crit was a crit, he would have died. Oh, that's really unfortunate. It's okay. Like, he already lost. Like, there's nothing he can do. He can't kill Merlin, which is my you know, biggest source of damage. And yeah, yeah. He was all like sealed on lifesteal. He couldn't properly heal. Let me buy some PP stamina. 
Alright, alright, alright. What was it talking about? Yeah, at that point he couldn't even heal, right? Because it, it, like if he was like level 3 Sario, right? In a regular match where you wouldn't get sealed on lifesteal, maybe he could have come back from it, but not now. <laughs> Definitely not now. Uh, let's just kill the, the one. Just straight up kill the one. Because then he just loses half his DPS, if not more than half. Yeah, that, 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 that AoE hits. I'm so sad the level, it, like, it could have killed. The level 3 could have killed if one of the hits that wasn't a crit, was a crit. That was just very unlucky. And Death Pierce wouldn't have helped because he wouldn't have given the 50%, so he wouldn't have killed. I think... Yeah, the extra 50% is much bigger than the 30 extra percent damage that you're doing for the crit resistance. Of course you get the extra, you know, technical crit chance, but... Oh, that sucks. I don't have an attack seal to combat that. Oh my god, that sucks. If only I had gotten an attack seal. Oh no. I might lose that because of attack seal. Can't lifesteal though. Give me, give me an attack seal at least. The ultimate, of course, but no attack seal. Oh, he might. He definitely can kill the, the Merlin by just double attacking, and Merlin's dead. And Guffer is dead. Well, maybe I should kill Sario. Merlin's passive and shave, they just attack multiple times, I guess. <laughs> That was just unlucky. He attacks with me and I had like 15 billion attack cards and only one debuff card. That was just very unlucky. This time, you know what? <laughs> Sario, you can, you can go. You can go, Sario. I'll deal with the one later. He can't even life steal, you know? Only has single targets. Sario, you can go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you go, you go. Maybe killing Sario is just better. Because uh, then you don't have to deal with uh, those, his AoEs. His AoEs are the worst. Because, uh, yeah, if he just single targets Merlin, that's a problem. But AoE, he will already do 40% on Merlin and just do all the damage on Gulfer and Lucille as well, right? Oh, I'm scared of that hit. It's gonna be level 3, isn't it? I can attack Seal next turn. That's Pog. Actually, I can double kill. I wish I had Merlin cards, but it is what it is. So we're gonna do this. Yeah, we can just double kill the Ascona, I hope. Ludo? 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 Right. Merlin cards, please. Wanna do a, at least one more AoE. Kill the Galford. Give me some AoE cards. Oh, he's gonna shield anyways. I mean, I can just break the shield with Ludo though. Kill the golfer? You're kidding me. <laughs> You're kidding. So let's double rank up Merlin before Golfer is dead. I just want to do one last AoE with Merlin, just for good measure. Alright, just for good measure. Gimme. Gimme AoE. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. You you shield, right? You're gonna shield. You're, you're gonna you're not. That's fine, I'll rank up, I'll rank up, I'll rank up. Actually, I'm happy Gofrey didn't die. You know what, I'm happy Gofrey didn't die. Let's just do this and uh, we're done. That was alright. See, I don't know man, without Ludo passive, she ain't crazy. Without Ludo passive, units change. <laughs> Units with our little passive are not the same. I swear. Still was a lot of damage though. It was like what more than half her uh, more than half her HP, basically. It's really good. Definitely really good. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Good combo, but I just prefer Death Pierce. Just for that single target. The single target will of course do more damage if you have Death Pierce. If it crits. If it doesn't crit, I guess it doesn't make a difference, but if it crits, it will definitely do more damage. Alright. Thank you guys for watching.